guys, what's up? It's your girl Nisha here, and I'm back with another haul. So I'm a little late with this haul because this haul is a Black Friday haul. So we did have Black Friday, I think like two or three weeks ago, but I wasn't able to film this video just because I was busy with my final exam. So I got really busy studying. I was kind of behind schedule. So I decided to film it right now. So I'll definitely be showing you guys all the things I picked up during Black Friday. I didn't pick up as much uh, this year just because we are in quarantine and we aren't working as much. So I did pick up a few things that were on sale, some of the things that I needed and some of the things I did want to try. So it is kind of like a mini haul. If you guys want to see what I got, then keep watching. So the first thing that I got is I did some shopping at Pandora online. So everything that I bought um, during this haul is online. I didn't go to any stores whatsoever just because I was at home, I was in school. So I got four things from Pandora. So it, it came with like these little cute Pandora boxes. So I did get three rings and one charm. So I'll show you, I'll start off with the charm first because it's only one. So the charm that I did end up getting is this cute little stethoscope. If you guys can see it. It's just like a tiny cute little stethoscope. I did get it for myself because I did finish my first semester um, at med school. So I kind of wanted to congratulate myself uh, for working really hard because especially with your first semester uh, from undergrad, it is definitely a game changer. It is very different. The workload and the work pace is a lot more faster than undergrad itself. So I thought that with completing my first semester of med school, I would just like congratulate myself with this cute little stethoscope. So I really like it. And then the next three that I got are rings. I am a huge ring wearer. Um, you don't see I'm wearing rings right now. But like when I go out and everything, I do love to wear rings. I do love to accessorize and stack with rings very much. And I do have a collection of the Pandora rings. So I wanted to get a few more, especially a few designs that were discontinuing. And it was on sale. I believe they had like a 40% off sale. So it wasn't bad. It was a pretty good steal. So I did get three rings. So the first one that I got is this cute little two beaded ring over here. I'll put it on my finger so you guys can see what it looks like. So it's a cute little diamond stud right here. I think it looks really cute. I don't have a ring like this one, which is really odd because I could have sworn I did. But when I checked, before I shopped, I made sure to check what I actually had to make sure that I didn't repurchase anything that... I already had because that actually happened when I was going through my collection I did notice that I had two of the same rings and I didn't even realize I have two different jewelry boxes with them I have one that are for occasions and one for every day and I noticed that I had two of the same rings I'm like wow did I actually purchase two without realizing that I actually had the same one at home so to prevent that from happening again I double checked so I'm really glad that I got that ring over here. So the next ring that I got is a really cute one. I had my eye on it since it did um, come out, but I didn't convince myself to get it up until now. But it's this really nice homage shape, or I think it's called pear shape. I forgot what shape this ring is called, but it's an homage shape. I think it's a teardrop ring. It looks so pretty. I know like a lot of engagement rings are like this style, but girl who's gonna get engaged for now so I'm just like okay you know what I might as well buy a ring that looks just like this and it just looks so pretty I can imagine wearing this during the summer and definitely like stacking up on a lot more rings and it just looks so nice and elegant and the last ring that I did get is this cute little cylindrical ring it is very similar to the first one I did show you but one of my friends owns this ring and I saw her wearing it one day when we went shopping and then I'm just like I really like it so the Black Friday still came I'm just like I need to get it and I believe this is the ring that's being discontinued but it's a really nice like wrap around ring and it has the same design as this one over here with the diamonds but it looks so pretty i just love it it's a really nice like statement ring that you can wear on its own and then stack some other rings on the other hand i just really love it, it looks so pretty like i just love rings like literally as you can see so those are all the things that i did get at pandora so i also did get other jewelry as well so i did shop on swarovski I don't own anything from Swarovski. Ironically, I never shopped there. Um, I never got gifts from Swarovski, so I was very intrigued to try it. They are pretty expensive. Like the crystals, they are lab created, so they're not real diamonds itself. Since they were having a sale and I do like rings, I did purchase another ring. So it came in this cute little box over here. And I did purchase this online as well, so I was browsing through the website. So this is what the packaging comes in. It is in their statement blue packaging. And it's so cute. And this is the ring that I got. Oh, that's the tag. Oh, okay. So this is what the ring looks like. 
It is a nice wrap around pier shaped ring. It is very similar to the first one I showed you by Pandora, but this one it does wrap all the way around. And I don't have a ring like this, and these rings are really popular and very trendy now, so I thought I would give this one a try. But it looks so pretty. The one thing that was really confusing from shopping from the website is transferring your your ring size because they go by like 51, 52, 55. And I was just like, which one's a size 7? Oh my god, this is the first time I'm actually trying this on. And it looks so pretty. I love it. I can definitely see myself wearing this a lot. It is very bulky though. Like because it does have the diamonds wrapping around, it is very bulky. And it is rhodium plated, so it, like when I was reading on the website, rhodium doesn't tarnish. Obviously, I don't like wash my hands or anything with my rings on. I always take them off, so I'll be very cautious about doing that. But I just hope this ring does last a really long time because this is the, my first Swarovski purchase, but it looks so pretty. Oh my gosh. And clearly my nails aren't done, so with everything done and all that, I can imagine seeing myself wearing this ring so often. I love it so much. So moving on from jewelry, my next purchase is from Charmed Aroma. So if you're not familiar with Charmed Aroma, they are very similar to Bath & Body Works, but they're very dominant in candles and bath bombs. One thing that's very different from Bath & Body Works is that their candles has jewelry in it. So once you burn the candles, they have a little plastic bag with a ring, a necklace, a bracelet. There's so many different types to choose from online. I previously owned two Charmed Aroma candles. One was a regular vanilla scent and the other one was an owl theme. And I do have them as decor around the house and around my room, which is one thing I really like because you can, just like Bath & Body Works, you can recycle and reuse these as decor around your house. And since they were having their um, Black Friday sale and they have their holiday collections, which is so cute, I had to get my hands on it just to use them as decor for the holidays. And I love their scents and the way that they burn. So I decided to get two of them. So the two that I ended up getting is this cute little reindeer. It is so cute. Honestly, like when I saw it online, I just had to get it because it's just such nice decor. And when you open up the lid, there's the candle and you do have to burn it, I believe like to one third of the way in order to get the actual jewelry. So the jewelry does come in a plastic pouch and you do unwrap it from the aluminum foil and you do have your ring, your necklace, your bracelet, whatever, um, which one you did decide to pick. And it has like a really nice like sugar cookie smell, which is what I really like, especially around the holidays, that really nice, rich, warm scent. It just smells so good. I can't wait to see. Both of the candles that I did pick up, they do have a Swarovski jewelry in it. I believe these two are rings. So this one is a, I believe it is a red Swarovski uh, ring inside. And the other one that I will show you that I got. It is this cute little ornament. How cute is this? And like even the little top here, it is so cute. It looks exactly like a full size ornament. Like this is so cute, especially like placing it around the house's decor. I love to reuse these. And when you open it up, you do have your candle. And this one's a little bit more of like a sweeter scent. It smells more like, like strawberry, like a strawberry cheesecake. Yeah, it's very sweet. That's what I really like about it. It's not overwhelming or too sweet. And this one also has a Swarovski ring in it. I believe this one is red and this one is white. I don't remember, but I will do an unveiling video of me unwrapping the rings once I finish burning through these. But they smell so good and they're so cute. And I was just glad I got to pick these up during the sale. I believe I got 30% off of both of these, which isn't that bad because these candles retail for, I believe, like $30 to $40. So I believe I got them for like $15 to $20 each, but they make such cute decor. So if you guys haven't tried the Charm Aroma candles and you're interested in jewelry, definitely check them out. They also have different themes for their candles and bath bombs as well, just as they have Harry Potter, Winnie the Pooh, Disney princesses. Like who doesn't love Harry Potter and Disney princesses? Like, they are amazing. I literally want to get, like, the entire collection. But I'm just happy with those candles. Uh, definitely check out Charmed Aroma. I'll definitely put the link down below to where the candles, so that way you guys can see, check out more styles, and definitely a lot more jewelry that they have to offer. The last thing that I did get from this Black Friday haul is from The Body Shop. I haven't tried any of their shower gels or their uh, body butters, but I've heard such good things about it. So they were having such a good sale. I believe with another discount code i got like 60 percent off of all of this stuff which is amazing and i believe the sale that they had was i think 30 or 40 percent off and then i used another coupon code um i used honey and then i ended up get saving another i think 30 percent. so i saved a total of 60 percent, and i got free shipping which was insane so i'll start off with the smallest things that i got so i did get one buddy butter so i ended up getting the body shop shea north 
I cannot read today. The body, the body shop Shea Nourish, Nourishing Body Butter. Nourishing Body Butter. So I got this size here. And I haven't smelled any of these yet. Oh, this smells really nice and fresh. Oh yeah, I really like this. I hope I like it because when one of my friends uses it, she says it's really nice and thick, but it blends like a dream and that's what I really like it. And I don't want to feel so like sticky and thick afterwards. So I'm excited to give this a try. And then the next things I got, I got two hand creams. I literally had to get as much stuff as I could to get the free shipping. I believe you have to spend $50 to get the free shipping. So I picked up two hand creams because like, especially in the winter and we're sanitizing our hands a lot because of COVID, my hands get extremely dry and I always like to keep hand creams like in the car, around, in my purse, around the house. So I got these two from the body shop. I got warm vanilla. Oh my God. I got warm vanilla and I got winter jasmine. So I got like really good winter scents. I haven't smelled their warm vanilla. So let's see. Oh, this smells so nice. This literally smells like a warm hug. It smells literally like vanilla, but it's not overwhelming and it's not too powerful and sickening. And winter jasmine. I love jasmine scented stuff. Oh, this smells so fresh. It literally smells like you get out of the shower. I love this scent. It smells so good. Honestly, like after this huge haul, I might get stuff from the body shop more often. And especially because the Boxing Day is coming up soon. So we're going to get even more sales. So let's see what I can stock up on. And then the last thing I got from the body shop is shower gels. I love bathing with shower gels. They are so nice. They have like this nice rich aroma and it just gives you a lot more clarity. I don't know if I'm looking too much into showers, but that's what I love about shower gels. So I picked up uh, four, five, seven shower gels. So the first one I picked up is Winter Jasmine. I picked these all up by random. I haven't smelled them before just because I did buy them online. So I went with generic scents that I did really like and some scents that I haven't smelled, but they were limited edition for the holidays. So I thought I might give them a try. If I didn't like it, I can always give it away to like a friend or my family. So I got Winter Jasmine. Then I got Warm Vanilla. So I really love these two scents. I'm so glad I picked them up because I really love the hand lotions and they smell amazing. Then the next one, I got Festive Berry, which is another limited edition scent. I don't think I smelled this one. Oh, this smells like, like, it kind of smells like cranberries, but it also kind of smells very foresty. It smells like a branch, like a cranberry branch. <laughs> it smells really good. I really like it. It smells like very like woodsy, outdoorsy, but you still have this sweet smell of the berries. It's very interesting. I actually really like these limited edition scents. I'm actually really shocked by the body shop. I don't know why I haven't shopped there more often. The next one I got is British Rose. And then I got the shea one so this one would pull really well with the the body butter and then the last two that i got is i got coconut because i really love coconut and i love to use it especially in the spring and summer i just love coconut so much and then the last one i got is almond milk and honey i got this one because i really like the lost satan almond oil uh body sh the body wash but that one is pretty expensive and this one was on sale so i thought and this one's good for sensitive dry skin so Winter's already here. My skin's pretty pretty dry. The Lost Satan one's kind of pretty pricey, so I thought I would try this one. Oh, it smells just like it. Literally, guys, this literally is a dupe for the Lost Satan, um, the almond shower gel. Like, it smells just like it. That's amazing. Oh, my God. I got this, like, at a fraction of the price. Oh, my gosh. I'm actually really excited to try all of this. Well, that is it guys. That is my mini haul for Black Friday. I know I'm pretty late with this video, but if you guys liked it, please like, share, and subscribe to this video. Please comment down below on more videos you'd like to see. And if you want to see more hauls just like this, if you guys want to see anything else, any reviews, definitely let me know. I hope you guys have an amazing day and hope you guys come back soon. Bye guys.